Hi Aquarius, how are you? Hope you're doing well. This is Deanna here, Intuitive D1111. Let's go ahead and take a look at the person on your mind and how they're feeling for you. We're going to have several different decks that we're going to use with the channeled message deck as well. And um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Okay, let's go ahead and get into it. So it says, I've written entire messages to send to you, but I always end up deleting them. My fear of intimacy paralyzes me. Okay, how's your person feeling for you? They definitely are having a hard time being open. For some of you, a lot of it has to do with, you know, their family upbringing. They, you know, they feel like it's a sign of weakness to be open for some of them. It says, I'm terrified of losing you due to my inability to be vulnerable. Look at this. This is the second card about this person having a hard time opening up. And if any sign gets it, I mean, Aquarius is, we get it because we're not going to let everyone know all of our intimate feelings. But at some point, you know, you, you just have to have the courage to say what you have to say, right? It says, I get insecure when it comes to you and I'm nervous and overwhelmed in your presence. Woo, Aquarius, what'd you do to this? person <laughs> they're nervous to speak to you they don't even know what to say i'm hearing for some of you they're not even responding to you because they really just don't even know what to say like they some of them they just feel bad because they know that um you know sorry won't be enough is what i'm hearing but either way i can't help sending sexual energy i always desire you listen aquarius you put it on somebody that left <laughs> Give another side. I told that too. You guys, make sure you check out your other uh, natal chart placements because these love message videos have been funny. It gets right to it, right? How's your person feeling for you, Aquarius? It says, I read every word you've written to me more than once. Yeah, this person's trying to come up with a game plan on how to reach back out to you. And it says, I'm constantly seeing signs um, connected to you. All right, so let's go on to the Mercury Edition 6 deck. What else does your person want to say to you, Aquarius? Excuse the noise in the background. We have, oh, when I'm not around you, I get sad. Aquarius, this person gets in their feelings when they're not around you. There's something about your energy that they love. Um, let's see. How's your person feeling for you, Aquarius? How are they feeling for you? It says... I hope you never hurt me. Yeah, they're afraid. You know, I feel like this person has been very hurt before and they're afraid to be, um, they're afraid to be open. It says with you, I feel so safe. And we have, it says, I never want you to question my love for you. So even this per even if this person is not around, you know, in your life 24-7 or you guys are on a break, they want you to know that they love you. They don't want you to second guess that, right? And they get, it says, I get so excited when I see you. So yeah, they want to see you again, Aquarius, after you put it on them like that. <laughs> Here we go. Let me love you. They're like, let me in. And you're just like, okay, we'll be vulnerable, right? Be open. Just, just say how you feel, right? Give me something to go on. All right. Let's get to the next deck. Let's get more into their heart space and see what's going on. For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as North Node, love messages personally. All right, let's see. What do they want to tell you, Aquarius? <laughs> influences. I'm distracted right now. And some of you, the influences is they need to stop smoking, drinking. I don't know if they're gambling or for certain people that they're hanging out with. Or certain family members I'm hearing they're, that they're hanging out with that are not a good influence. They need to let that go. It says secrets. I hid something from you and I'm afraid to tell you about it. Oh, now it's getting juicy. What's going on over here, Aquarius? <laughs> it says jealousy. I feel like you've moved on without me and that's difficult for me to see. Yeah, they thought that you were just going to be there for them, period. Let's see, Aquarius. How does your person feel for you? It says, so much has happened between us in the past. Can we work through it again? Unresolved. Oh my gosh, this person's upset. They're upset thinking this. Because <laughs> they, they know you're a baddie. They know you look good, right? They're just like, oh, I know that they're talking to somebody else. They're like, no, I got to come through. Look, in the very near future, I got to come through, right? <laughs> I can't. Oh my gosh. But the bottom line is they feel like there's obstacles in this connection with the mountain card here. It says something or someone is standing in between us right now. All right, let's get some channel messages from your person. I 
And I promise you, they definitely are distracting because I've had the most distractions with this video. Oh my gosh. Let's see, what do we have here? We should have gotten to know each other more. Yeah, this person's taking a trip down memory lane. They're like, you know what? All this time I spent invested in these other things that, you know, didn't even matter. I really should have been, you know, making my relationship or my connection work with Aquarius more, right? How's your person feeling for you, Aquarius? It says, if my friends felt how I feel with you, they would be in love too. Okay, so I don't know. Maybe they feel like their friends or certain family members or someone that they're around has something to say about this connection, which... You know, I don't feel like that should matter because no one has time for that. We're too old for that. We don't play that game. All right, Aquarius, how does your love interest feel for you? Oh, now they want to be quiet. Oh, there we go. <laughs> for some of you, they want you to know they're planning on coming back within the week. Listen, they want to make sure you're not talking to somebody else. <laughs> it says, I need to move slow with you, but when we're alone, it's impossible. I'm telling you, you guys are out here putting it on people in the daytime. Listen. Oh my gosh, another card came out. She was only supposed to be a fling. Listen, if they hooked up with somebody else. <laughs> oh, they're regretting that. They're like, look, this person was not supposed to be long term. And that's for someone, of course. This is a general, so that's not going to be for everybody, thank God. But listen, okay. Another message from your person, because we're definitely not going to end it on that note. <laughs> I get upset thinking of another man's hands on you or another woman's hands on you. Yeah, this person, they can't handle it. <laughs> and for some of you, you're not even speaking to this person anymore. So you're like, why do they care about who I talk to? Well, apparently they feel like uh, you're not allowed to talk to no one else. Let me get these messages together over here. All right. Another message for Aquarius. <laughs> How's their love interest feeling for them? Okay, they could be moving right now. I'm trying to get to love. They're telling me about everything that's going on in this person's life. It says, I never should have left you. Exactly, right? <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video, Aquarius. And if no one has told you yet today, I love you. You guys are amazing. Definitely check out your other side placements as well. Okay, take care.